Why should you care about the World Rally Championship? I'm John Marine and you're watching John Marine Tube. Subscribe, comment, friend, rate, but don't hate. Now, I, I'm meaning to tell you, I've been wanting to do a, this kind of video for a long time. Ever since the World Rally Championship YouTube channel, youtube.com slash WRC, ever since they subscribed to my channel, I've never gotten a chance to share why exactly the series is so amazing. So that's why for this video, this is a why should you care video, but also more of a passionate view of, as to why I care about the World Rally Championship. You see, people have all kinds of ideas as far as what are some of the greatest drivers in the world. Many will say Formula One race car drivers. Some even would say sports car racers. Hell, some people here in the United States will say that NASCAR are the greatest drivers in the world. But if you ask me, I would say that the drivers in the World Rally Championship and rally racing in general are the greatest drivers in the world. Every time I see a stage or an entire rally of a World Rally Championship, I just tend to marvel at the immense bravery and the immense skill of basically piloting usually a, a compact kind of car around roads made of gravel, of mud, of dirt, you know, going through sunny conditions, going through rainy conditions, snowy conditions, all just to try to shave off seconds and try to, you know, basically basically make quiet countryside roads just come alive with the roar of a, of a rally car. And the cars themselves are very sophisticated and very amazing to see. You know, I always, I have incredible respect for rally racing drivers, whether it's in the World Rally Championship, whether it's in Rally America, whether it's in the British Rally Championship, wherever there's rally racing, I have so much respect for them because I don't think I would able, ever be able to drive through the kinds of roads and the kinds of conditions that WRC drivers go through and especially to do it at many points around the world. And I can think of so many WRC races that I've seen on YouTube and such. And what started out for me in being a WRC fan was probably back around 2001 or 2000. But I can remember that I've been watching all kinds of rally events, including the treacherous Safari Rally. Now, the WRC no longer runs the Safari Rally, but if I think of some of the, like, one of the craziest rallies there is, the Safari Rally is up there for me. Other rallies that I enjoy, I enjoy the, the Swedish Rally, I enjoy the, the, the Finland Rally, the Rally Finland. I'm pretty fond of the of the, the uh, United Kingdom, uh, or the British Rally, whatever it's called. I even, I even have great respect for the Acropolis Rally. The Acropolis Rally is absolutely treacherous. I mean, it is, you know, you, you don't finish each stage, you survive each stage in, a, in the Acropolis Rally. And if I have to think of some moments that will stick with me as a rally racing fan, I would probably say that that epic jump by the late Colin McRae at Bunnings in, in the Rally Australia, we just took that Subaru way up into the air and then came down hard. I don't think he got to finish that rally, but that was so freaking cool. <laughs> And like I said, I have so much respect for the World Rally Championship and all of its drivers. I've become fans of people like Carlos Sainz, uh, Sebastian Loeb, and I think I even remember watching Petter Solberg uh, and some past YouTube videos I've seen, Juha Kakinen. And also when it comes to rally racing, sometimes I wish that I, I became a, a rally racing fan a long time ago. Because I wanted to imagine what it was like just to see those Group B rally cars, you know, like the Lancia Delta S4, the Audi S1 Quattro, and, and cars like that. I would love to see what rally racing was like with those beasts running around these uh, these rally roads. And I don't really have too many favorite rally cars of all time, but if I had to nominate one, I would probably say the, the, two, the Peugeot 206 WRC. Even when I play that in games, it's a fantastic car to drive. Oh, by the way, I'm also a fan of Marcus Grunholm, among others. But there's so many reasons for me to care about the World Rally Championship. Maybe you can find something that you like about the series. 
There's absolutely nothing like the World Rally Championship. It is a fantastic racing series, and you really have to hand respect to all the drivers in the series. Not just certain drivers, not just certain co-drivers, not just certain rallies themselves. Respect everything because, you know, they put themselves on a limit basically every rally, every stage. And for them to race as fast as they can across these kind of narrow roads and through these forests and such, you have to have respect for everything that they do. And if you don't have respect for all that the WRC does, then honestly, you're not a racing fan at all. So that's why I care about the World Rally Championship. And that's why I love the World Rally Championship. And I wish they would bring it back to Speed Channel so I don't have to have Discovery HD, which, which I don't have, just to see the races. But still, that's why I care about the World Rally Championship. And I love the series. John Marine here, and I'm signing off. Thank you so much for watching this video, and I want to salute all of my friends and subscribers around the world in many different cities and countries. Love and peace from down here in Houston, Texas.